funny, funny. <laughs> Why would I have a countdown, Aaron? <clears throat> These here are um, from all those uh, baseball cards I sorted. There was um, some marble stuff in them. Just want to kind of show those real quick. Um, these ones are Marvel, um, some Halloween stuff, Storm as a Witch, Professor X as a Wizard, Colossus as a Vampire, but got some nice Marvel out of that section. <laughs> uh, Got a good bit of them. Um, these are mainly masterpieces. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Got scared, huh? Scary face. These are normally the better sets, uh, the 1991 stuff. These are in bad shape, not worth getting graded. Um, Wolverine's Claws, always a cool one. Uh, same with these ones here. I have this one. Actually, I got it graded. This one down here. Some uh, Magic the Gathering cards. Nothing really great there. Uh, there was one I wanted to really show. Let's have to find it real quick. The rarest one that I have right now is probably the. Um, Darth Vader, uh, Star Wars Galaxy, uh, PSA 10. Um, I have two of them. Uh, I've had a rare one. It was an air card, C3PO, um, called Goldenrod. Um, I sold it. It was a PSA 6 for $250. That was probably the most expensive. This one's about 150. Um, I can't find the spawn card right now, but if I get it graded and it comes out to be a nice grade, it would be worth about 200, 250. But those were just the ones I found out of the um, all the baseball cards. This is the set I'm going to be opening today. Um, it's a mixed lot. I don't know exactly what's in here. Nice. Nice kiwi. That's awesome. How are you doing today? the first time I've opened a pack like this. So I don't know what to really expect. Alrighty. Oh. So we got some Maverick. Star Trek Voyager. Tech World. The Hunchback of Notre Dame. Beauty and the Beast, but it kind of looks like it's in German. Uh, Star Wars 
Star Wars Trilogy Pack. I love Lucy. Shrek. Asia. Independence Day. These are the extra wide ones. Got uh, Terminator 2. Bingo. X-Files. Cinderella. Toon World. Saved by the Bell. The College Years. Uh, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Clear Set. Garfield. Muppets Hockey. And Sabrina, the Teenage Witch. This gonna start. Yeah, yeah. Um, these were. I'm guessing somebody bought out a bunch of like car shops and made these boxes that were already used back. Oh, that's an embossed card. Temporary tattoo. Survey card. Guess there's a contest card here. A new world. Some freaking going on with these ones. Don't know a ton of Star Trek stuff, so I could not tell you these characters. <laughs> I don't think this is Shatner though. Yeah, this is a uh, Voyager, so I don't believe Shatner would have been in this set. This looks like a puzzle piece. This is a raised card. Um, Melix. Don't know him. Okay. Definitely put that one to the side. Got these Independence Day ones. Uh, so this would be the movie. But they're extra wide. See anybody really wanting those cards?
this looks like it's from the movie. It's the sticker. up I don't know if anything there is worth anything. Hey Mr. Mumbles, how are you? Yeah, Garfield is a classic. Uh Power Rangers 96. So this is again I think the movie. Yep. This is Saved by the Bell, the college years. This one, the foiled. In pretty good shape. Might be a little dim there. The Adventure in Tune World. My upper deck. Um, 1993. Daffy. Didn't realize there's seen on both. Bunny, uh, Bubby Bunny Harris OS. So that's supposed to be Jill Montana with Bubby Bunny on his back. That's an interesting set. I 
got Cinderella. King cards, one pop out, one active card per pack. Um, this would be 95. There's a pop out. You can see, it looks like uh, you can make the castle stand up. This looks like a holographic card. Number two is five. Checklist. This looks like a puzzle card. Or like if you have more of them, it makes like a blue carriage or the opening scene card. And this set, I believe this would be the card to look up. Holographic castle at night. Just set it aside. <clears throat> Don't know a lot about a lot of these sets because they're not hugely popular. This is X Files. Yeah, of course. Um, what's up, uh, JD Entertainment? Yeah, um, there's always people looking to try to complete sets. This is X Files. So some of these scenes are different. Signs of some bricking here, which is when the cards stick together. Yeah, which one? This is a nine. And then I have this one, which is a 10. That's a hair on there. And I have two of these ones. They're tens. Exiles episode one, so one, deep throat, UFO design, proposal number eight. Bingo, movie trading cards, ten. This is circa... Nineteen ninety one. So this is a true like wax pack style. Um, a lot of these sets used to come with gum in these packs. Nothing there.
beach. Ready for the road. Then our ring. And fire. Uh, I can't do it. Family tree. Another wax pack type. Terminator 2, Judgment Day. Buy stickers, so these must be all stickers. Which can have value. I've sold stickers, uh, definitely the Nintendo ones. It's another wax pack. See, there's wax on the front of this. Sarah Connor. Battling van. Protector or assassin. We've got a re rescue mom. Sarah's nightmare. Hey, what's up? Yeah, I think this one will be the one out of this pack. Um, do a little cleaning on this. There's some wax on here uh, from the packaging. It's kind of common. Uh, you can get that off. So you have to be kind of careful because these are stickers. They're not cards. So they're made. It says peel up here and everybody stuck them on everything. But look to see if it's worth anything. I got Anastasia. Five cards per deck. 5 in this deck. It looks like um These are like scene cards too where you would butt them up. I don't think I have anything that matches. And then on the back, it looks like that too. Yeah, like that. Thirteen. Yeah. So you wanted to try to collect them all, make the scenes. I wish PSA would be able to grade stuff like this together, because um, some of the Marvel stuff did that with two cards, had fight scenes, and to get them graded in the same slab. This is Shrek. One of a kind PSAs and printed plates used to produce these cards. You will receive a randomly selected print plate in a limited available order. Don't be disappointed. So there's possibility of a plate card in here. Odds of finding uh, animation cell cards are approximately 1 in 15 packs. 
Stand up Shrek character cards approximately 1 in 10. Odds of. This is from 2001. So this is the. Well, Shrek is the movie, so. That was about the time that that movie came out. TV show back in the day. This is from 91. anyone let me see all the shuffle stirring up trouble hillbilly heaven dancing fool say cheese All tied up, making headway in Hollywood. Funny in France. Definitely a show I grew up with. All right, what is this? Five movie trading cards. The trilogy. Star Wars, obviously. 1997. So I'm guessing this, these came out when they did the remakes. These are not the originals. The original trilogy came out in 77, 80, and 83. Fortunately, I think this pack is ruined. No packaging. Having a hard time even getting them out of the packaging. Yeah, that's what happens sometimes when these like stick and sit on top of each other and just get com compressed. I don't know if this can be cleaned at all, but there's a pretty big ding in the corner. Yeah. That's the, I have a it's a trap scene. being compressed that long too so if it was sitting in the stack um, it's called bricking and uh, just from 
the coating that's on the covers on the fronts can cause that. This is Beauty and the Beast, 1992. But it looks like there's some German writing, so I don't know if these are in German. They're not. 1992, though. Oh, there's a photo on the back one. Some nice, I see them a little thick cards. And we got a foil cast stone with the above. And this, I would say, is a sticker. But that's a nice one. I have to look it up. This is the Hunchback of Notre Dame. There's a puzzle. And then this is a pop up. Quadrimoto Fulo. This just looks like a maybe a bookmark. Oh, it's a pencil topper. Interesting. Cast the picture. This one's missing that thing already. And then I got a puzzle. Activity card. And then there's this little game booklet, I guess. It's different. A lot of different types of cards here. William Shatner's. Trek World Random Packed Check 
Trek Chrome and autographed cards. Interesting. So, there might be a good Shatner autograph in here. Definitely more comic style. And had some breaking down on too. I'm looking on the back because sometimes they sign the back of these. So yeah. No luck on that one. Maverick, the movie cards. This looks like a behind the scenes show. for a chrome card so a foil card in this set This is Suprema, the Teenage Witch. Uh, look for randomly inserted autograph cards and chase cards. So, an autograph card would be nice in this.
don't know if any of these would get anything. I'll look them up at some point. And the last set, Muppets. Take the ice. NHL, obviously. Jim Henson. about these ones, but they're kind of that mix between sports cards and not. Uh, like the Buffalo Sabres, the Edmonton Oilers, New Jersey Devils, kind of a cool one. Uh, Los Angeles Kings, the, these history ones aren't that great, I don't think. Um, but these kind of cartoonish team cards. That is it for the opening. I do want to show you guys these cards again. I did do a PSA reveal on these ones, but I got a PSA 8 here of uh, You walk Venom eight nineteen ninety one. This is a um, what they call an etched foil stormtrooper PSA seven nineteen ninety four Galaxy uh, Lando Calrissian. I got a bad grade on this one. It's a five. I'm guessing there was something I missed on that one. Well, obviously. But. I got the Wolverine 1991 Marvel's Universe. This is a 9. I have the 10 right here. Um. 1994 Star Wars Galaxy uh, IG-88 9 93 Star Wars Galaxy Han Solo PSA 10 93 uh, Galaxy again C-3PO 10 I've had him before in a 10 uh, Another Vader 10 Obi Wan Kenobi and a nine. And this is a another Wolverine nine. Another um, IG eighty eight nine. And then another Ewok. This one's a 9. I think that's a cool card. Um, and then I had this Vader card. A 
as a nine. And one of my favorite ones is this Yoda um, drawing or writing at a desk. It's a PSA 8. Great, great score on it. But, yeah. That is going to be it for the opening today. Um, if you guys are interested in any of these cards, let me know on any of the social medias. Um, I can get you a price. I do mail and ship things, so it's not a problem. Um, I don't know if any of these cards will be graded or not. I will have to look at it. Um, if you see some of the Marvel stuff that I showed earlier in the stream, uh, message me. I could get you a quote on those. Um, but until next time, I will catch you guys later. Have a good one.